Hi everyone, it's Sandy. Thank you for joining me. I received my uh, package here from Tapology and I'm really excited and I thought I'd do an, un an unboxing and uh, share with you what's inside the um, box and I'm really excited to see what is inside. So I thought let's go ahead and I'll unbox this in this video and see what um, I've received. And I'm going to put down below the link to Tapology and all the items that I'm going to share with you in the box and also my uh, discount coupon code so take advantage of that if you're interested in purchasing anything from Tapology's uh, store you can use my uh, discount coupon code and um, I've done a few a um, couple of unboxing videos for them in the past and you can also I'll link them down below in case you want to see what else um, they have that I had received. Oh, look at all of these fun stuff! Look at that! Look at all this yumminess. And um, there's also a little card in here for that they put in the box to say thank you. And um, oh my goodness, look at these! I'm already in love with what's in here without even knowing what I've got. And I'm going to tell you now, if you are into a lot of shabby uh, projects or vintage style projects or junk journaling or using fabric or trim or stickers, they have everything in their, in their store for you to use uh, in any of your crafting projects. So let me just I'll start with this one first. Oh, look at this. It's even packaged beautifully with this lovely um, like vellum kind of packaging with some glassine paper so it looks like there is um, a bunch of wooden spools with some chiffon trim uh, these were great because I I have been using these chiffon trims to make um for my tags and to use to for closures for my junk journals and these would be great to make uh, for your snippets or fabric clusters so inside I'm trying not to be too noisy with the crinkling and you know the good thing about the way they package their items you can reuse their packaging as well and you can alter it and you reuse them again for your projects so I'm going to just just oh, so I don't have to cut it let me just grab them away. so let me just move this up here first I love this packaging. You know, you can. This would be great to alter. And you've got this window in here. I can make a window pocket. So I'm not going to throw that away. Well, let's have a look at this chiffon trims wrapped in these wooden spools. And you get. This is exactly how you will receive it. If you like the um, trims, this is how you will receive it in the uh, pack. So it looks like you'll get one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve spools of chiffon trim in various colours. I mean, these colours would be perfect for any of your uh, craft crafting theme colours. So these are all the lovely colours, and the width of the trim is it's about uh, one one and three quarters inches or about four centimeters wide so yeah it's about one and three quarter inch wide i'm not too sure how much you get in the length but there is quite a bit in there so you'll be able to use quite a bit and sometimes i cut it in half so you can get um uh, you know you can get a lot more if you want some thin strips of trim for your uh gift tags but these colors are lovely colors let me just try and bring them up closer for you and i'm hoping i'll be able to get some a couple of projects uh, to make with these and um so while i'm looking at these i'm just got I'm just trying to think in my head what i could make with these lovely um items in this box so this is a nice color i think it's like a taupe and there's a purple or a lilac lavender color a lovely sage green or a, a dark olive green color 
that was one dog snoring by the way <laughs> Uh, this is a lovely color too. It's like a mustardy, mustardy color. I love this. I love this pink. It's like a salmon pink. I'm sorry about the lighting. The lighting might not give you the best color for these um, chiffon trims, but I mean, you could see how lovely they all are just sitting here. And then you can reuse these spools again for your own trims and wind your own trims later on. Reuse them. So I think this is great. So. That's what you get um, in this pack if you like these the chiffon trims in the spool. So let's put them there first. Oh, what else is there? We have some beautiful embellishments. They look like flowers. I'm not sure if they're paper flowers or fabric. I'm going to love this. Um, nice frosted seal paper bag this would be great to, to reuse or alter oh, these are nice flowers so there's a whole bunch of these uh they're like a nice soft fabric so it's not quite fabric it's like um i'm not sure what you call it like um crepe crepe paper feel but it's not not plastic but it's a nice textured feel and um oh i can't wait to use these i think i might have an idea what i could make with these but so these are all the variety of colors you get in the pack so there's quite a few of these or different colors and the size of these flowers are and just approximately it's about five centimeters or two inches so they're like a, a two inch size flower so it's a good size so these would be great maybe to add onto your tags or the cover of your journals or your pockets or use just for embellishing on your other projects and these beautiful colors so these would go well with any of your uh, any color project using any colors that you're using for your project so quite a lot of these of these these are nice this is a nice color and they actually will go well too they will match your these chiffon trims so if you wanted to coordinate them with it so these ones so you can see how nice they will go together with the greens. You wanted to use the green tones with cream. So that these colours would match well with them. So this is another one. Just to show you how they would match really well. So you can see these colours. I don't know if you can hear that in the background, but he is having a wonderful time sleeping. So I've got my new craft room and it's, it's really enjoying this room. <laughs> my little baby boy. All right, so there are those flowers. So I'll put them to the side as well. Just put them over here. And then we also have, this looks like some, okay, I think this one would go with the rub on. So let's have a look at these. Oh my gosh, look at these. Oh, look at the packaging. Oh, this is so nice. They even put some lace on the top of the handle just to decorate that. I like that idea. And they just use some bra a brad to hold the trim in place. So I could reuse that again. That is really cool. Look at, all, look at that. There is a whole bunch of tools wrapped in these uh card spools so i would think let me see i think i'll just take this out all of their items are just beautiful i have to say they have a lot of things they have so much stuff there in their store for you to um to have a look at and purchase so some bit of lace 
socks and the bread, which I can reuse these. And I would think you just open it up like this. It's a great storage bag for this sort of stuff. Oh, this is just beautiful. Look at all this. I'll just put that to the side. So you get a whole bunch of different variety of tool and with um, some of them have some pattern prints on the tools. Well, there's quite a few of these. I mean, these would be great for all your projects. Oh, look, look at this one here. I love this one. Look at this. And it's quite a bit of it. I, I'm not too sure. On the listing, it, it will tell you how long the length is. Uh, when you have a look at the product item and the width of these tools are go this way it's uh, six centimeters wide or just over two and a quarter inches wide so there's quite a fair bit here and you can you know make these into little clusters and snippets add these to the covers of your journals or um, your tags I love this one. This is by so far my favourite. Just love all of that. Let's go through some of the other ones and have a look. So, so far, that's my favourite one. I can't wait to work with these. Well, I'm already excited. <laughs> um, oh, this is a nice one too. This one's got some little flowers on, on the actual tool. So that's quite a lot there as well. And then you can reuse these card spools again for your own uh, trims or you could uh, embellish them and then uh, you can gift them. Actually, I think this one is folded in half, is it? Oh no, it's not, it's just one, oh, one, one layer. But yeah, so again, you get quite a lot in here. So that's this beautiful one with flowers on it. This is just as lovely. This is, oh, they're all just beautiful. These ones have um, some white flowers. I'm trying to see what I've got here that I can put so you can see. Um, hopefully you can see. I don't have it. Oh, I've got this here. Maybe this will help. Just so you can see a bit better. some nice white uh, flowers with some gold speckles and some gold glitter on it so that's that one these ones are on smaller tags so it looks like you get two different um, you get a tag and a spool shape so there's a couple of different varieties there these ones this one here has some gold stars on it And they're all the same width and I would believe that would be all uh, all uh, the same length as well there's that one this is a lovely green color just a plain olive green color so I'll go that way so that's another lovely color to use it's just a it's just a plain colored tool we have this one here with um, moon and star nice and pretty this would be great too I think as a Christmas um for Christmas thing crafting projects so that's in silver this one's really lovely and this one's beautiful this one's got some um, gold leaves and a sort of embellished or placed on the tool oh these are love look at the colors on these iridescent sort of colors all different colors on there so 
this would be great too for your projects. It's just pretty, very, very pretty. Um, we have also another one here. Oh, this one's beautiful. This one's got butterflies um, placed on the tool. And this is like a white color. So there's just a whole bunch of uh, butterflies all over the tool, which is just as beautiful. You could even cut these individually and sort of cut around. So just cut around it and then um, decorate your projects with these two. So I've got a couple of ideas so far that I think I'm going to do with these fun pieces of trims and flowers. This one here, oh, these are beautiful. Oh, I love this one. I don't know if you can see it, but these, they're like little flat, like, um, they're like sequins, and it's got some sparkle on them, and they've, it's just sort of been sprayed all over or you know glued onto the tool so it's a nice sparkling see all the lovely colors beautiful different different size um, circles on there it's just lovely just lovely all these ones have butterflies It'd be great if you're a if you a love butterflies don't know where the end is, just so you could see. Let me see. I think it's just here. This would be great for butterfly theme projects. Look at the bright colours on these, aren't they just beautiful? Look at that way. The blues and purples and pinks. Very, very nice. So these are the prints that you will get if you would like to purchase these tool trims. And you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you get 10 spools of different variety of their selected uh, tool trims with beautiful patterns and shapes. So that is definitely a great buy, a great buy. And it's packaged in this lovely um, clear um, bag too. So that's the other one. And what else do we have? So I'm gonna pick that one. Oh, what's this? This looks really nice. So this has also been decorated with some more trim, which I can reuse. I'm just going to use my fingernails to undo these. So there's a couple of little extra bonuses. We've got some extra trim. We all love trim and lace and ribbon, especially if we're into journaling or junk journal we always love these sort of um pieces even a little small piece like this can go a long way in all your projects i mean i just use some little pieces of this and cut it out and then you'd be surprised what you could make with just a small amount so there are i've got two different laces here which i'm so happy to have so let's see what's inside this seal bag. It's quite a it it's quite a lot of it's a nice bag too. Oh my goodness, look at these. They look like they've been die cut. Uh, these are papers, different shapes with beautiful shabby vintage theme prints. So let me just see what we have here. Oh, this is so pretty. And this is a heart shape. These are heart shapes with beautiful shabby prints. And they're not thin. So there is a little bit of uh, weight to the uh, paper. So it's 
that'll be great so it won't tear as easy it's very delicately uh, intricate uh, edging to the heart shapes and they're just stunning look at these I love the prints Look how beautiful these are. These are definitely something um, to, to have, especially for your uh, your journals. Oh, there's just so many in here. Look at these all different hearts. I love all of these floral prints because I just love florals. I love playing with florals. It's just very feminine and soft and uh, just very, you know, very dainty. So these are all the heart shapes. So there are a few heart shaped ones. And they're a good size, so I think some are smaller than the others. So there's a smaller one. That's a larger size. It's just just beautiful. And these will make great little journal pieces to can write on the back. So there are some hearts. Oh, how many was it? There's quite a few. Oh, if one. Let's just quickly go. To one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. You get ten pieces of these um, ornate heart shape uh, paper die cuts, and then these ones are circle shaped ones. These ones look like doilies. They're actually they look like doilies, so I would say they're like doily. Oh, I'll have to. There is the names for them, which I should have written down. But I'll, I'll put all the links down below with all of these and their names. I should have um, got the names from my list. But here they are. Just pretty, very soft pink colours with nice cream tones. If I had my phone, uh, my phone's on the recording. I should have got my laptop, but um, to give you the names of what these are. And then there are some square shaped doily shaped ones. Lovely purples and lilacs. I think you get 10 of each. Oh, this is pretty too. I don't normally work with purple colours, but looking at these purples, they're just stunning. So, I might you know, play around with the purple tone colours, because I think they are just as lovely. Another one. Okay, so we've got those. There are these ones. A very generous amount in the pack. So look at these ones. And they just cut so well. Just cut really beautifully. I have a die similar like this, a Dolly die. I have a couple actually and when I run mine through the uh, cutting machine sometimes I don't get all of the holes punched out and sometimes it doesn't um, look as nice like this or sometimes it's torn on certain parts and then it's just um yeah I just can't get it through the um, cutting machine is great so I'm not a real big fan of the intricate ornate uh, die, uh, die shapes to cut through my machines but these ones are very well, very well cut through. These are pretty ones, just beautiful. Definitely one to purchase if you love working with florals and flowers and shabby. So these ones, you get quite a few of these too. So there are the circle uh, shaped doilies. It's the square shaped ones. And then there's some more of these ones. And then there's the heart shaped ones as well. So a generous pack for all of your projects. So that's those. It's just 
just beautiful. Love it all. Love it, love it. Cannot wait to work with these. Oops, let me just put these out to the side. I won't lose them all. Oops, so I'll just put them there for now. Let me just move this box and see what else is in there. So the final um, pieces of um, items in the box. These are Christmas rub-ons and these um, other ones. So this is um, a Christmas collection images of rub-ons. So just in time for Christmas, you can purchase these. These are available now at Typology. So there's a whole bunch of wonderful Christmas themed images. I mean, look at that. You get a whole bunch of these rub-ons. And I'll show you how to use these rub-ons in uh, a project. Oh, look at these. So many. Then there is this one. This is another one. I like this one. I like this page. This page is lovely. Beautiful angel. Stockings. Oh, look at these. Oh, look at these. Oh, these are adorable. Oh, this is... Another lovely one. Look at this one. There is a ton of these rub-ons per pack. These are the word sentiments. These are great too if you're um, doing card making or you want to make some tags. Just cut some plain tags and just cut out these and then just rub them onto your plain tag. And there you have a Christmas theme tag. Or even a um, for card making, just make some little small note cards for Christmas. So you get um, six in a pack of all these wonderful Christmas theme rub ons. That's for that one. It also comes with a paddle pop stick so you could rub it off onto your uh, whatever base you're going to rub, rub it on. And there is a um, these like um I forgot what you call this what do you call this it's the um, oh goodness when, when i get the product item i'll list it and you get uh this nice generous amount that you could use to do some rub-ons onto here and use these for your embellishment so that's this one so that's the christmas theme and then there is this one here these are row on jumbo size i would say you probably get six sheets in a pack of these ones as well but we'll have a look and see what's inside Get out. So this also comes with a paddle pop stick as well in the pack. So let's grab these. Oh, I love these flowers again. My favourite flowers, all kinds of flowers and leaves, botanical uh, flowers, and these are a nice large size too. And then there is this one. This one's a, a yellow theme one. Different yellow flowers and sunflowers, daisies. White one. I don't know all of my flower flowers, but I know some of them. And then we've got next one oh, 
this was these are very long but you can cut them down if they're too long for your project so you can trim them down along the stems and some leaves an assortment of leaves and some more leaves and you know same with these ones you can you know cut them down and layer them so this one has one two three four five six seven eight so actually actually this has eight in the pack so again another generous amount of rub on sheets per pack plenty to um, use in your project so this one will be definitely well worth purchasing and I've done a, a little tutorial on how um, I use these rub ons and actually I have let me just show you I think I did have my other don't know where my other glue bottle is, but here is one of the rub-ons that I used from one of the uh, rub-on sheets that I had, and I placed it on one of my glue bottles and decorated the glue bottle with one of the rub-ons, and then I decorated the top part with a little dangle. And I think this was just really pretty to decorate my glue bottle. Did have another one in my may have just rolled down somewhere, but I did do a um, a video on it. Oh, here's the other one. Found it. So here's another one. As you can see, I also done the same and added a dangle with some charm and charm and pearls. So that's just another way to use your rub ons and decorate your glue bottles. Aren't they pretty? So I will be back and I want to share with you maybe a project or I'll do a, um, a um, video, a process video and make something along the way so you could have an idea if you wanted to purchase any of these lovely items just to give you an idea of what you can make with them. So these are some of the rub-ons, that's a Christmas one and all of these, look at this, so much stuff and then there's all these lovely doilies. So uh, again, I will link all the products down below for you, as well as my 15% uh, uh, discount coupon code. So you get a 15% discount coupon code if you use uh, my code. And um, so I hope this was a fun little uh, unboxing haul for you to have a look at and give you an idea of what some of the items are available now that's uh, new to their store. So, um, yeah, so thank you for joining me and I'll see you soon with a couple of projects. Bye for now.